So, uh, Josh Duggar gets denounced for sexual impropriety with underage girls while he himself was underage. Um, after he's just spent, I don't know, a long time kind of denouncing everybody else, I guess, through his association with right-wing lobby groups, um, denouncing other people for their immorality. So, everybody's denouncing everybody else. You know, like a, an apocalypse now, what do you... What do you call it, Kurt says, when the uh, assassins accuse the assassins? <laughs> uh, because, you know, Montel Williams, um, handsome fellow, gazillion dollars, always on TV, the temptations must be enormous. You're as human as Duggar is, Mr. Williams. Um, but it's an interesting thing, this business of ethics by denunciation, and it, it points out a sort of insanity built into the very heart of our modern ethical system, and that is the idea that um, we have to decide who are the good people and who are the bad people. You promote the good people and you harm or thwart the bad people, I guess. Um, you know, you get just everybody pointing their finger at everybody else for their immoralities. Uh, partisan politics is particularly brutal for this kind of thing. And, um, you know, it ends up uh, just, you know, Who's the biggest scumbag of them all? <laughs> that's that's all that the that the ethical debate has become. Um, thing is, though, we're all humans, you know, human, all too human. Um, what gives anybody the right to denounce everybody else? But let's face it, we're all in on the act. Um, Addendum is a bit of a you know circus freak here on YouTube for his habit of denouncing everything and everybody is horrible, hellish, disgusting, selfish self-centered and everything like that. But as I say, I, I find um, in Mendham is pretty uh, useful in his own way, simply because he points out that tendency in our own society and um, brings it into very sharp relief. Um, the insanity of that kind of ethical system. Uh, he just does an end run against everybody else who denounce any, who, who use, uses den denunciation in their ethical position and uh, denounces them. You know, it's like the old revolutions. It was that the French revolutionary said, I think it was Collodier Bois, he says, the revolution est comme uh, Saturn. Il, uh, il dévore tous ses enfants. I think that's it, although my French is not all that great. Um, the revolution is like Saturn. It devours all of its own children. Uh, you denounce somebody, and then a year later, you get denounced for something that was acceptable last year. You know, it's just everybody is eating everybody else in that kind of an ethical system. Um, but again, I go back to my favorite line from Apocalypse Now. I mentioned Kurtz. Even the jungle wanted him dead. <laughs> um, the jungle wanted him dead because the jungle is neither good nor evil. It doesn't promote or prefer either side. It just is. The jungle is neutral. Kurtz decided the jungle was bad, so he decided he was going to side with the jungle and be a bad person just to show how uh, at least he was honest about what life was about. It's about survival of the fittest. Survival as an end in itself. Um, no, Kurtz. <laughs> you might think the jungle is a bad thing. The jungle just is. Um, and... You, Mr. Kurtz, are the one who are, who's bringing morality into it. What do you call it when the assassins accuse the assassins? Well, what you get is Walter Kurtz, I guess. <laughs> or, um, you know, Montel Williams, maybe. 